Welcome back to North of the Broad, everyone. With me now is Ashley Hauk. She is the president and CEO of Baja, which is the Buford Area Hospitality Association to talk about the second year of the Buford Oyster Festival. Lot going on in January. First, the restaurant week. Let's let's talk about that. That begins January the 13th through the 22nd, but you can go online on January 1st and start looking at everything. So yeah. welcome and let's talk. Thank you. Thank you for having me. It's so exciting. And we're so excited to have it at its full capacity and have this big bang of a festival yes. celebrating the oyster culture. So Tides to Tables, mm -hmm. this is going to be our Beaufort Restaurant Week. It actually coincides with South Carolina Restaurant Week. And so we want to invite locals out, tourists, right. visitors to come out and support our restaurants. So within the Restaurant Week, each mm -hmm. restaurant is going to have a special menu devoted to Restaurant Week. And within that, we're hoping that um, um, the restaurants will have some type of oyster dish or appetizer or even a beverage, you know, oyster right. shooters or something. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's how that will pair. All right. Mm -hmm. And to find out which which restaurants are participating, uh, website? Yeah, so it's www.bft oysterfestival.com and we'll okay. have a full list there. Okay, perfect. We're also on Facebook, okay. Beaufort Oyster Festival, and we'll definitely keep that up to date. So the Oyster Festival really begins on Friday with an event and then of course the big event on Saturday. So let's kind of go through the yeah. details of Friday night. Yeah, so throughout that week from the 13th to the 21st, we celebrate Tides to Tables. Then on the 21st is the kickoff to the festival. Okay. That's gonna be at the um, Waterfront Park okay. in Beaufort, downtown Beaufort. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna have many different educational elements of course oysters we're gonna have oysters yes. three different ways um, maybe more and we'll have um, entertainment live mm -hmm. entertainment it'll just be a big celebration here in the low country I think it's interesting Ashley that there'll be nonprofits and organizations there representing kind of the educational piece of it um, like Port Royal Sound Foundation and others. Who else is going to yeah. join? So we have great relationships with the Friends of Hunting Island, the State Park. We've got the South Carolina DNR. We're really excited to have them. Of course, Port Royal Sound Foundation. We've got the Outside Foundation coming. We're going to really make sure that this is an ethical event. Uh, the Outside Foundation is going to be there bagging up the oysters so that those will go back into the Eight. marshes and uh, support yeah. you know the conservation of the oyster. Very very good. I'm a big oyster person. <laughs> And you were mentioning earlier that you're going to be actually having oysters in three three different types. The yes. steam, the... Anyway, go through that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we're really excited to present them the way the locals do it. So yes. the traditional with the burlap sack over a fire. Um, Sutton Construction is sponsoring that. Okay. These will be the Maggioni oysters. And then we'll have Sea Eagle Market. They're going to be doing steamed oysters. Okay. And then we'll have Lady Island oysters, the raw. And probably have some fritters in there and different things as well. But those three will be judged. And we're, we're really excited to have everyone try those and tell us what their favorites are. Would you say it's a family event? So Absolutely. Bring your kids and, and they'll be, you know, let's say you don't like oysters, there'll be other food. Yes. Available yeah, we'll too. definitely have some other foods that are non-oyster related <laughs> uh, for those that don't have that palate. So. And music. Yes. We have four different bands. We have two on Friday, two on Saturday. Local bands. I'm here in the low country. So. We're really excited to Very dance good. and eat oysters and get be, to shucking. Be so much fun. So put this on your calendar, everyone, January the 13th. And then the 21st and 22nd is the big oyster festival. The restaurant week is, is prior to that. So thank you, Ashley. Thank good you so much. to see you, so you again. Yeah. Happy holidays to you. And thank you for joining us. And we'll be right back on North of the Broad, everyone.